speaking of Draymond Green, so there's a rapper whose name is Cameron. You guys remember yeah, Cameron? Yes, Cameron. I do. Cameron had some limited success about 20 years ago. Oh, limited? <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. He had a couple of hits. He had a couple of hits. Couple. He had some limited success. <laughs> More than a couple. Two, maybe three. In, in any event, this is not a, a knock on Cameron's career. I, I, think it like is. It. If it, I guess you know. it sounds like. A... <laughs> <laughs> so I want to be very clear what I'm about to say to you. This comes from Cameron. This is not me. That's not you. This is not Tim Hardaway. Right. This is not Cody Decker. Not putting no words in his mouth. Not only that, this isn't even. May he rest in peace, James Jones. This is from. <laughs> Ke- this. This is from Cameron, okay? James Cameron apparently knows what caused the beef between Jordan Poole and Draymond Green. This is merely an allegation. Right. All right, good? Yes, all it is. Uh Have I set it up proper now? Yes. He said three things. Cameron did. Number one, his claim was that what started this was that Jordan Poole, who went to Michigan, uh, said to uh, Draymond. to Draymond Green that I was more successful with the ladies at Michigan State uh-huh. than you were, and I went to Michigan. That's not enough to punch a guy in the face. You didn't say we it agree? quite that I'm trying to I'm trying to say in a manner that morning TV allows, uh-huh. Cody. Okay. I like this job. It's the only job I got left, all right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. The second thing <laughs> that he claimed was that uh, and I'm paraphrasing here, of course. Yeah, right. Of course. After they won that title two years ago, he apparently said to Draymond, good luck in Sacramento. I'll be staying in Golden State winning titles. We're trading your ass. Now that gets a little personal. And then the third thing he allegedly said was, you're broke. I'm about to get the bag, and you ain't getting another contract. Now. That's all from Cameron. Mm -hmm. Are any of those stories worthy of a guy being like, you know what? Go bleep yourself. I'm going to punch you in the face. Okay, now this is what Cameron said Jordan Poole said. Correct. That's the claim, yes. Yes. But we don't know what Green said. Back. Back. Yes. Or before. Jordan Poole said those things. Well, we better go call Cameron up and find out. But but this is what I'm saying. (laughs) If you you can't take. The stuff that's getting dealt to you, right. don't deal it out. Bingo. That's what we always say. If you can take it, yeah. then you can dish it it's out. Called, but if, there's a term for called playing the dozens. Right. Where And we do it on the show all day. Exactly. I'm going to bust your chops. You're going to bust my chops. Exactly. Back. If you can't deal with that, then you got to get out of the kitchen. Right. Yes. Right? Because exactly. that's the way it exactly. goes. And but, Draymond but, Green's but, a notorious but, trash but, talker. But, yeah, he's notorious yeah. trash talking. I guarantee you, he started it. Pool. Just took it a little bit better than him. Responded, he right? Responded a little bit better than him. And the team, you know, when you, whoever gets the the better of who, <laughs> you hear, you hear a little giggling, the giggling gets a little bit louder, and right. you're like, ha ha ha, you know, ah, <laughs> right? Yeah, oh, that's one up on you again. Yeah, and you know, and that's how it gets going. It, I think Draymond Green um, got a little frustrated. She heard this and to I, me, and I think, and I think that he couldn't take it anymore because he was. You he know. was on the losing end. Right. It's like in the scene the, in Goodfellas uh, yeah. with Spider, and then the other guys go to Joe Pesci. Right. Are you going to take that from him? Right. So he shoots him in the foot. That's yeah, the way right. it goes.